A warm welcome to Fatorda. We were here often in the past two years of life in a bubble, but now we're back to normality and the fans are here too, thankfully. They're eagerly awaiting one of the clashes of every season in the Hero Indian Super League, Goa versus ATK Mohan Bagan. A bad ball over the top this time, and Ashish Ray up against Redeem. How on earth has that ended up in the net? What an astonishing angle to get the ball into the net from and power. Carlos Pena is celebrating, Redeem kept going, and all of a sudden, Ashes is beaten away, and the ball ends up in the ATK net. But uh, it's an astonishing goal. Ivan has joined in, and... Uh, <laughs> Well, it's the craziest way for the deadlock to have been broken. And that is because Asics Rai got caught for watching. Didn't realise that run and the outside of the overlap of Ivan was going to cause all sorts of problems. Yeah, and stand up big and strong there. Ivan just says, I'm going to take a punt here, and just smashes it straight over his head. It's a great, great goal for Goa, who deserve it on the balance of play so far. It's an awful goal to concede for ATK Mohan Bagan. My, oh my. Ivan's uh, only previous goal came in the 4 all draw with Kerala in March. Well, we've been saying it half time, and that end up 2-2. We're just pleased to have got the first goal of the night, and it's goal number 100 of the Hero ASL season 2022-23. We'll have to do something if Goa find a second goal from this Edu Badia corner kick. And they do, and they do, and the big man, Barish, he's come all the way from Syria to head the ball into the ATK Moen began that with goal number 101 of the season. And maybe Goa are going to make a bit of history here by beating ATK Moen began for the first time ever. Don't argue with that. Come on as a sub, again, substitutes very much on top. This match week, match week seven of the Hero Indian Super League, and it's another sub that gets his name on the score scene. Whereas Anu just drifts in there, he's being marked, but Hamill doesn't challenge him. Let's take nothing away from the quality of the delivery. Everybody puts it absolutely on a tee for Anu just to be able to get in front of Hamill and you cannot allow that to happen in your own six-yard box. They've been punished, and it looks as though the points are going the way of the Gores. Big points for the big man. But uh, inside, there might be toilet seeding. All ways to lose them, to win and lose matches. If Noah finds the target here, they might well have won it. It's got in. It's 3-0. He's hit the mark again. Wow, hey, Noah, four in five, has come on as a service, the broadest smile in the whole of Goa on the face of the coach, Carlos Pena. You're going to ask a question about Fischel on this one, but the man who got the goal again, Noah Sadai. Well done, son, because he's taken the shot on. A great goal card finish. He'll take his yellow card, yeah, thank you very much. But more important to him is that goal. Four in five games. Really speculative. What is the keeper doing? He's diving and all he's got to do is stand there and catch it. Hamill goes to close down. Pritam Kotal tried to nick it in front. Just catch the ball. He's pushed it in the back of his own net. Basically, it's the irony of football. He was the hero for five minutes, wasn't he? In the first five. He made four or five saves. And now, but well, got to go down as a clanger. But that's the second one in this game, John. And he's cost them. He's cost them. If he stands up for the first, up for the second goal, there's no problem. That one, he stands there and catches it, or does something with it. They're still in this, there's only a goal in it. Three nearly finishes, three points for FC Gore.